almost uh, three months before i was sitting in my home uh, doing some you know uh, emailing to some of my friends by the time i received a phone call from my office philokalia foundation office saying that someone is waiting there and i asked from where are they they said uh, this is a lady who is from goa she came to attend routine in divine routine center muringur after the routine throughout the routine she was waiting that uh, thinking that mario will come to give the talk but i did not went there on the stage so she inquired where is brother mario nobody gave proper answer you know friday after the retreat when she came out of the gate on the right hand side she could see a philokalia foundation office so she went to the office and met the receptionist and said i want to meet brother mario very urgently so i was at home immediately i came to the office and we sat together and we spent some time you know what is her problem she said brother mario many times i heard your talk on youtube as well as in divine routine center earlier and i attended many of your convention in different parts of india and you used to say that there is a word for every problem word of god is the medicine and if you know what is your problem and if you consume this medicine definitely you will get the deliverance now i am in a problem i am working in a company last 15 years all my colleagues those who were joined in the company in the same time they all got lot of promotions and they got increment in their salary and they are in a well reputed positions but i am in the same place last 15 years and i'm i'm not getting any increment in salary i'm not getting any promotions in my job i'm fed up of it sometime i think to leave the company because the owner i think the owner is not very happy with me because i don't i don't encourage all his sinful or you know bad life that may be the reason but brother mario please pray and give me a word that i may be able to get the promotion you know i spent some time with her in prayer after the prayer i gave her a word from bible that is from colossians chapter 3 verses 23 I repeat Colossians chapter 3 verses 23 whatever you do work at it with all your heart as working for the lord not for the human master I repeat my brothers and sisters it's a word of almighty god that says whatever you do work at it with all your heart as working for the lord not for human masters when you do any work in any company or in any place remember that you are not working for the owner of that company owner of that firm but you are working for the lord think that way and work and i said by talking to you i understand that you have lot of grudges and you know you are not happy about the company about colleagues about the friends and you are murmuring you are complaining it is not only that you are complaining to me you came to me for a counseling and complaining maybe you are compla- doing the same pro- problem in your home you may be talking to your husband the same way bad about the company you may be talking to the children about this company bad you may be talking to your friends about you know you may be talking bad or uh, uh, no not good things about this company remember that god is very angry to the murmuring people when the israelites they were led from the egypt to israel they murmured and then god you know god, god give them a small punishment you know what was that they would have reached within 3 days or 4 days to israel but it took 40 years in desert one or two generation in desert why because they murmured so never murmur about the problem in your company just do your work as you are doing it for the lord then the lord will lift you up and i gave her two more verses because i know that word of god is a medicine and sometimes medicine you know it's not only one medicine three medicines you may have to take for some disease and ailments so the second word what i gave is philippians 419 philippians 419 and my god will meet all your need according to his riches of his glory in christ jesus you know what i said i said you write down i give her a pen and paper and i say write down the word like this and my god will meet all my needs bracket 
salary increment promotion in the company according to his riches of his glory in jesus christ my god shall supply all my need bracket what is your need the increment of salary and the promotion according to his riches and glory i said write down this and repeat every after breakfast after lunch after dinner something good will happen because this is a promise of the lord now you see because i promised that i will come to the office i came to meet you isn't it the same way when god promises something you must use that promise and speak to the lord because you promised give me what you promised god promised my god shall supply all my need according to his riches and glory so my god shall supply all my need and what's my need uh, the promotion in this company according to his riches and glory he will give after that i said suppose if god give you a an a suppose if god give you a promotion which is very hard task for you which you have never done and which you have never studied what you will do suddenly your uh, owner of the company or general manager is calling you and asking you to do something very tough which you have never done what you will do then she said i don't i, I, I don't want that kind of promotion i need the promotion in the area what i have i said no if god give you any promotion to do any job you must be ready why because we read in philippians 4:13 i can do all things through christ who strengthens me i can do all things through christ who strengthens me such a beautiful and powerful word from almighty god i told her my sister it is not that accidentally you came and meet me many people came to attend routine this week in divine routine center but none of them met me you came out and you saw the board of philokalia foundation and you met me here which means god want you to meet me and if you meet me it is not accidental because he has some plan you know what is his plan he want you to memorize all these three verses the first thing that your job should be to the lord not for any human honor just sincerely do your job the second thing god is going to provide all your need according to his riches and glory and when he provide your need he is going to strengthen you to complete that task which god gives to you so i give all these verses and i said if it is possible write down in your bedroom and if it is possible write down in a paper and keep it in a in your pocket very often you look at and read that because whatever you think you must say it you must utter it because what you confess that is going to possess so i taught her how to memorize this word how to recite this word so look at the word touch the word read the word hear the word memorize the word and recite it every after meal she went one month over nothing happened second month you know what happened the general manager of the company fell sick and he is very elderly and it was already time for him to take retirement when he was sick he was admitted in hospital there was nobody to substitute his job the owner of the company asked this lady can you do some emergency work of this general manager she went and she remembered the word i can do all things through christ who strengthens me and she started doing one by one one by one and owner was very impressed and when the general manager took the leave the owner appointed this lady there and now she is general manager and she said brother mario last 15 years i did not get any promotion but within 3 months i got the promotion till general manager all the promotion together all are jealous of me all are unhappy and they all know that i went for a routine in porta they think it's a power of that routine i know it is the power of the routine i know it is god guided me i know it is god who gave me this promise my god shall supply all my need the promotion according to his riches and glory 
and if we give any promotion i can do all things through christ who strengthens me not only that when i am put in any position i will work as it is i am working for the lord not for the human master so my brothers and sisters when you listen this talk if you know anyone who is suffering without a job or who is suffering without promotion or who is suffering with financial difficulty please send this video that will they also will get the help and they also may recite these verses they also may come to attend the retreat and when they all get some blessings you will get 1% of blessings from them it is such a beautiful things when you do some good things for the others the lord will repay you